Hello friends, uh, welcome back to the channel myesimhelp.in uh, In this video, we will look at the one of the free SAP le learning platform which is called as OpenSAP So this learning platform will help the beginners and also for the people who are already into SAP who like to upgrade their knowledge sets in multiple areas this is one of the easiest and quickest learning ways to go to the browser and type the URL which is called open.sap.com so once you click the URL which is open.sap.com then you will be prompted to enter your SAP logon credentials that's the open SAP credentials in case if you already have a SRP user IDs uh, which is nothing but our uh, you know <coughs> support user IDs then you can use them if not then you can register for a new one so in case if you don't have any S user ID then it is better to register and the whole process is simple and it is also free so if you don't have it then click on this register button so it will prompt you for your SAP logon name whichever you prefer and the email address phone number etc it is a like a regular registration for any URLs so once you are done with the registration it sends you a confirmation email so please open the mail ID in which you have given the uh, during the registration and then in the click on the confirmation email to activate your account once your ID gets activated, then you can go to this open.sapurl.com. Then you can use your credentials to log in into this URL. So here there are multiple filters to identify the courses which you can do. So here if you see, I have filtered it based on the courses. So I have selected Enterprise uh, Micro Learning Pods MOOCS and the language is English and then who will be the target audience and what is the topic whether it will be in industries etc so there is also search buttons which you can use and try to identify this so here if you just in this screen you can see uh, you can see about selected logistic innovations digital marketing or in case SAP business by reason a lot of things are actually getting prompted but once you apply the filter then those relevant courses will be listed for you and uh, believe me there is tons of courses inside which will be very helpful for us to upgrade our knowledge and uh, every courses are very structurally designed with all the basic informations a lot of topics are covered in terms of you know uh, to cover it in depth in every area uh, here you can see there is a learning tab, discussion tab, progress tab, collaboration space, course detail announcements. So all these things you can check it out and they are very informative. Like in case if you select this uh, gain experience with S4 on logistics, just an example I have selected this. Then I can go and check my progress in case if I wanted to see before I enroll what is the course details that also I can just check it. So let me take you there. You can see here the course contents. So unit 1 to unit 9. So all the what are the co topics that is covered inside this course are all detailed. And uh, you can go in any order. So you can start with unit 4 then go to unit 9 or unit 1 then go to unit 2. So but uh, it is very flexible. You can select in the areas that you wanted to focus or you wanted to learn. So you can click that and you can go you can go to every unit and then you can take it forward from there. In case if you wanted to collaborate with some people who are already into that then you can click the discussions on the collaboration space that will take you there. And some of them uh, you know some of the courses once you've completed you even get certificates from opensap.com. So I highly recommend everybody to look into this OpenSAP.com and then try to, you know, increase the knowledge levels uh, with the available content in this OpenSAP.com. 
thanks for watching uh, do leave a comment uh, or any suggestions that you have thank you